Hi everyone, this is Janae again, and I am going to share my uh, Studio Calico kit for the month of, what's this, June, I guess. Um, and I got the main kit, uh, which I subscribe to, and I get the uh, Project Life kit, which I also subscribe to. However, I um, this will be my last month of the Project Life kit from Studio Calico. Um, I did my six-month stint. Um, and I've enjoyed it. Uh, it's just that I kind of wanted to make a change and, and kind of check out some other kits. So I have, um, uh, next month I'll have another, a kit from another company. Uh, so this month will be my last Studio Calico kit, um, for Project Life. I am going to continue to subscribe to the, the main kit for now. Although I've also subscribed to another company for their, for their main kit, um, as well, which I'm getting that actually this month. Um, and then I'll kind of go going forward, make a decision on which one to, uh, to stick with. But, um, yeah, so just kind of wanted to make a, a little bit of a, a change, you know, sometimes after a while you feel kind of, I don't know, stunted or one company gets a little stale or monotonous or whatever, um, and some other companies just have some different colors going on, whatever kind of suits you. So, um, and it's good to try to give another company a, a chance too. So I'm excited about that. Okay. So enough babbling. Let's go to this kit real quick. Um, I didn't get many extras this month at all because like I said, I got that other kit from that other kit club. So, um, didn't get anything really extra except I got the neon, sorry for the noise sequence from Studio Calico. Um, that's them there. They're party. They're, uh, like, ir or not iridescent, but like translucent, I guess. And then I got the, um, these ones. And they're like, a like a salmon-y color, I guess. So, those are pretty, and those are literally the only extras I got. Okay. This kit was called Roundabout. So, those little cards. And this is a little bag comes in. This is the stamp set. And it says Adventure Number. Um, this must be some new packaging they're doing now. Huh, funny. With love from Kentucky, it says. I'm in Tennessee, so. But my husband works in Kentucky. Um, so, yeah. Stamp set's fine. Uh, these are some die cut shapes, and they look like clouds and arrows. And to be honest, uh, not not my favorite. I guess because they're just kind of black, and I can't alter them or anything to kind of match a project. So mm, I don't really like those. Okay, these letters, basic grade acetate alphas here. Oop. So and they're all in different colors. So, that's them. Uh, these little frames, they kind of look like um, over, uh, overlays. I wonder if these are from DIY shop, crate paper maybe? I don't know. But they're pretty. They're about... Let's see. Three by three? So, that's those. And then a couple of... These aren't exactly flare, they're like... What is it? Just kind of hard plastic or something. And that one's pink with a little camera. And that one's a geotag. So you just get two of those. These basic gray uh, metal studs. Which, I don't know, they're okay, but I would have sure liked some more enamel dots, I'll tell you that. This really tiny piece of twine. It is red and navy and white. Um, these are the... Urban Urban Traveler Simple Stories chipboard stickers, and there are 45 of them. Uh, glare. Hello, glare. So, these are okay. This kind of reminds me of uh, Glitz a little bit. They're new. I don't have a lot of things in Glitz, but that reminds me of that. Okay. Um, so now, that takes care of the the embellishment so there's not a whole lot there and that's a little bit why I wanted to kind of go with try another kit club um, the studio calico kits to me I guess for the amount of money you pay um, 
seem a little thin. <clears throat> so I, I love their papers. So I'm gonna, that's why I continued with the main kit because um, some of their exclusive papers are phenomenal. Um, but but overall, the embellishments. I mean, if you don't have a good, I mean, if, you know, and these chipboard. If you don't have a good stash of some sort or something to supplement, there's just no way you can get. Uh, you know, layouts that, I don't know, that have any sort of substance to them, as far as I'm concerned. And let's be honest, the stamp, I mean, the stamp measures, it's about the size of a matchbox. So, not a whole lot you could do with that. So, unless you buy, like, their add-ons, which those seem pretty thin, too. Um, or, like I said, have a stash, which most of us do. Um, there's not a whole lot that you can do with the embellishments. And so it was seeming a little thin for me, so... That's why I knew one of the kits had to go. So, okay, papers. Sky Atlas. That's pretty. It's called Sky Atlas, and it's, I guess, exclusive. This is the other side. This is the side for the kit, though. So it's like clouds and, like, a map. So, that's cool. And then Optimism. So it's that side. And then this side. Oh. Another Studio Calico exclusive, I suppose. Um, and that's the side of the kit. Um, this one's today, and it just has all the black and white, and has all the uh, months of the year. And then this is the other side. So that's pretty. And this one is Divine. This line, oh four. Um, it's really pretty. It's gray. And then the this this uh pattern is just like in a darker gray. And it's made in Poland apparently. Um that's the other side which is really pretty. Great. No, I love paper from Poland. Apparently I need to find a pen pal there to send me their paper and it's super heavy. It feels good. This is pretty. I like Polish paper. Okay, crate paper. Pure the Peer Collection, which I don't have this collection, so I wasn't intending on buying it either, so that's kind of nice to have a sheet of that. Oh, that's kind of cool. So, and this paper's called Carousel. This is from Simple Stories Urban Traveler. That's really pretty. And then this side... And this is called Pack Your Bags. Yes, please. Okay. Basic Gray. Basic Gray. Cardi Postal Canal Street. So it's just got like circles with random numbers and letters in them. And then this side, I'm not sure. Is it like an underground subway system? Like, you know... I don't know. Uh, I don't really like this paper. I guess you could do something with this, but that's just that's just kind of offensive. Uh, I don't know. It doesn't really go with the kit. Uh, whatever. Okay. Urban Traveler Jet Set. <clears throat> jet Set. On arrows. Ooh, I like that. See, I always think I love that, and then, like, this side, and then I can't do anything with it because it's too busy or something. But it's just pretty to kind of look at, I guess. And then, of course, your four pieces of cardstock. Ooh, that's a new color. Red. Uh, Off-white. This tealish color they always give you. And then, of course, a craft. So, it's showing up pink there, but it really is more reddish than pink. Okay, so that's the main kit. And like I said, I'm still subscribing to that one. Okay, here's the Project Life kit. I'm going to try to go this really fast. And apparently we're not getting the bags anymore, but they're putting it in this really fancy box. Which, you know, that's great. But I'm not really paying for packaging. I'm paying for product. So I like... I mean, I don't care. Put it in a... I don't care. Wrap it in newspaper. Just give me a lot of product, and I couldn't care less. But apparently... Somebody wanted a really fancy box with a magnetic seal, and that's what you got. And pretty crinkled paper. Great. Okay. It's telling me it's the roundabout collection. And a sorry 
uh, flare. Apparently, some stickers from last month were not in alignment, and they were sorry about it. I don't know. Here's the stamp set. And this one's actually a little bigger. This measures four by three. Well, yeah, I suppose it goes into the Project Life sleeve, and it's like a wonky uh, Polaroid. That's kind of cool. Again, really fancy packaging, which probably costs a lot of money. Feel notes in that wood. Let's see. Right there. That's three by four. And then here's this gold, like, it's like embossed or letter pressed or, or something. I don't know. Whatever. Um, some overlays. There's a four by six and a three by four. Little stickers. And these are gray. I like them. I like these stickers. Um, okay, these stickers crack me up. These are thickers. Mm, no, these aren't thickers. <laughs> uh, these are like, if thickers had a baby, that's what it would be. Um, so these are cork. I'm not sure how I feel about them because I'm not sure what I'm supposed to spell with two A's and two E's, one F. There's not a whole lot here if you get my drift. You know, if you're going to send me thickers, send me, send me thickers, not thickers, love child or something. Okay. Here are the four by six cards. This one says as, th and then, and they all are just grid on the back. So I'll just show you the front and then a little map deal. Take a picture. It'll last longer. This looks kind of watercolorish. And then these two. So. That's those. And then the smaller cards, we'll go through real quick. Um, four by sixes, or three by four, sorry. Map. This one says note. Really pale at the top there. And you have this guy, this guy, cameras. Today is the day. I love that. That reminds me of sunsets. This one, which whatever that one that's cute this one uh, that this one says the good life it's like faded out hearts this one this one is chevron that I love that one too sunsets Noted. This one says currents and loving. Um, that one. Hello. Awesome. And then these guys. So that's it for the Project Life kit. Um, again, seems a little thin, but when they send you fancy packaging, um, you know, they give you less product, apparently. So, um, so yeah. So, I'm excited to, to try out a new kit. I mean, this one's fine. But, you know, like I said, for the money, um, I'm not sure I'm getting the value that I had hoped for. Um, but I, their kits, you know, to begin with were good. And I did my six months. So, um, I felt like I gave it a good shot. And that's about it. So, if you have any questions, please let me know. And I'll be back with probably... I really need to show you guys some projects, so that'll probably be my next video, probably tomorrow. Okay, have a good night, guys. Bye-bye.